I want to read a comment that's in his book, The Cool Jet, on Amazon.com. Because, you know, through NBC, we sent them to Northwestern. And they just honored them six months ago at the alumni meeting. But let me tell you what made him tick. A professor told him, you have the best voice in the class, but you'll never make it in radio because you're a Negro. Oh. <laughs> it's not where you come Say from, that. Dr. King said, it's where you go. All right, <laughs> say that. Please go to Amazon. Real, 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 real. And get his book. I know. I, 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 now I. I, 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 Don't you love him? I love his spirit. Always will. Our going right there. Man. This is fire. Coming up next. Nelly. I bet you he's got the most I colorful know. jacket in the whole room. I love him. My <laughs> radio brother. I know her. Meant so much to him. One time for most you love. Amen. Moody. Moody. Say amen. Woo. For real. Linda. I only got two minutes. Robin. Where's Morgan? And Evan. I love you. And ain't nothing you can do about it. Thank you for having me here to speak on the program on a man that I love. opened the door for me literally in radio. I was running late as usual, trying to make an entrance. Heard when opened the door. I said, I'm working with Doug Banks. Who is this thug trying to get into the radio station? <laughs> Who is this? I said, I'm Ramonski Love. Who? I work for Doug Banks. Are uh, you late? And he shut the door in my face. <laughs> Doug had to come out and get me. But he was a person who I've been listening to since I was nine years old, Carter Elementary School. And we have a lot in common We're from the projects. We're both Libras. We went to Hyde Park Career Academy. Uh -uh, I think we got fired more than anybody in radio. <laughs> in terms of he did not trust anybody who did not get fired. So we had that in common. We got fired the most. We got fired the most. And we got the lowest pay when we first started. $35 a week. My guys, I think, paid oh. me just a sandwich and a milk. <laughs> <laughs> today, today, because of this man right here, not giving up, uh, yeah. <laughs> I want the number one radio station in the city of Chicago. I think the nation and I think the world. I love you, Herbie. I love you, Herbie. I love you, Kirby Rogers. Kid. Who's that? Continue to push. You got to pray until something happens. You got the power to move something. Hey, 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 Nelly. That's my brother Ramoski Love and your brother too. One more time. <laughs> All right, let's keep this thing rolling. Now let's hear from the family. All right, show love. This man will want you to show up. This is his grandson. Make a lot of noise for him. Oh. Evan. Hey, come on up. You, didn't tell, you didn't tell me it was nothing. Trailblazer. One day is my favorite term that I get to use yes. the granddaddy. Yes. The reason why I have so much respect for that man, I feel like that's why I'm playing right now because he never once pressured me to get a video. Mm -hmm. Not one time. This man encouraged me to be my own man. All right. He's my own man. Because of kings like this, young kings like myself, and the brother back there, we know the statistics. We have dreams and aspirations. And Herb Kent showed us that your past don't define you. 
Who would have thought a man born in 1928 from the Ivy Wells Projects okay. were going to be in the Radio Hall of Fame in 1995? Jim Crow would be where he is today. And I'm a house packed with people who love him together. So I leave you all with this. Legacy is my learning day. Legacy is not defined by any tangible rewards, because we all know you got a million of them. I seen them when I was a kid, I seen them all. Mm -hmm. But you're defined by the event you leave on others. And most importantly, you're defined by the ones who love you the most. So on behalf of myself, my mother, and my family, thank you all for coming here today. And I love you all. Oh, boys. Thank you, Evan. Nice job. <laughs> Talked to her earlier this week. I know he loved her probably more than anything in the world. Ladies and gentlemen, let's bring her to the stage right now. Our friend, the lovely Robin Kent. Please.